for the sign of Gemini, hello and welcome to my channel. And thank you for joining me. So let's see what's going on here. So I'm getting an energy of a lot of support. Um, this could be someone coming towards you that wants to be very supportive of you, uh, nurture and heal any type of situation or problems that came up or might come up. And this, this person wants to um, be beneficial to you. Yeah, they may have some good benefits. Someone you're dealing with may offer you something that's worthwhile. Put it that way. Put it that way. They may offer you something worthwhile. This could be someone you're dealing with or someone coming towards you. And they want to, yeah, they want to be very supportive of you. So, like I said, let me say it again. This could be you, someone coming towards you, or someone that you're dealing with. So let's get into the reading and see where this is coming from. So we've got this temperance card for the present time and the high priestess. Now temperance, it's about all your relationships are going quite well. But you may need to look at some deep personal issues and see if they're standing in your way. And if they are, how to work through them and integrate them. Because when you get temperance, the ideal is to find balance in yourself and your relationships, your goals and aspirations. Take a look at anything you feel guilty about, any past mistakes you've made. Forgive yourself, then let it go. Because it's the only way you can truly make progress. Now, it's with the High Priestess as a spiritual card. It could have some sexual overtones. It can mean that you're in a phase where you're going to be much more physically attractive to others. The High Priestess. It's tied to the moon. To uh, femininity. To inspiration. It's also a time to rely on your intuition and your inner knowledge. Rather than your conscious mind or intellect. So it's important to pay attention to your dreams now. If you keep a dream diary or a journal, it'll probably be a really good idea. So basically the High Priestess and Temperance coming up here for the present time. It might feel like a mystical time for you when it comes to love or with your person because um, there's a lot of attraction here. It's a time when you could find people literally throwing themselves at you. Yeah, if you're single, the problem is that you'll attract both, the good, the bad, and the ugly. So it's going to not be easy to tell which is which. Which you got the power of femininity at your disposal. So that's for um, if you're dealing with someone, they're deeply attracted to you. You got a lot of attraction, a lot of mojo for you. And if you're single, yeah, you, you could find a lot of people... They're coming towards you. They want to get to know you. Or they're just really attracted to you. A whole lot of people. Not just one person. And it's with this temperance card. So you're going to need to find a peace of mind. If you're dealing with a lot of people that are coming at you like that. Find balance in yourself. Yeah. The High Priestess is an interesting energy. It's, it can be a quiet energy, a wise teacher. The High Priestess sits really pretty. They pull back their energy. They come across as mysterious. But you also need to find balance. I don't know if all this attention will throw you off. Or just, maybe you just need to let go of some past mistakes. So that you find balance. So that you can deal with all this attention that you you might be getting coming up. Could be towards the end of June. Could go into July. Or like I said, it's your person who's deeply attracted to you. So let's move on over. Let's take a look at your person, how they see you. Like the Nine of Cups and the Ten of Cups. The Nine of Cups is one of the most uplifting, pleasant cards to get in a reading. 
It's known as the wish card. It can mean that what you're hoping or dreaming about is most likely to be yours in a brief period of time. So the appearance of this card, it's about happiness, good things to come. It usually means that what you want is likely to come into being in your life. And if you're asking a yes or no type of question, this card is the most powerful indicator of yes. So they see you feeling blessed and satisfied. They also see you like the Ten of Cups, which is the tops. The Nine of Cups is just missing one cup, so it's that's pretty darn good also. So Ten of Cups, it's another one of the most uplifting cards to receive. It points to happiness, perhaps in a more mature, grown-up kind of way as opposed to the Nine of Cups. Either way, it's a good card. The Ten of Cups speaks about a happy family life, even if you're single, to the overall well-being that goes beyond you, to include those that you're concerned about, your parents, siblings, children, your pets, and much more. Also, you can be spiritually fulfilled at this time. Great card to get in a reading, regardless of any question. Everyone wants a Ten of Cups. So they see you as a dream come true, and they see you as blessed and satisfied. So they could see you, you as, just remember the roles can be switched. Now, they could see you as feeling blessed and satisfied about this connection. They could also see you as feeling that this is a dream come true. Now, let's take a look at how you see them. Now, don't forget that with this Ten of Cups, um, it could mean that, um, keep in mind, if you're in a relationship and it's not made formal yet, take heart, it's coming. Don't sabotage things that are causing any problems where there really aren't any. I just wanted to throw that in there with the Ten of Cups. Because it's also about the relationship moving to the next level. So, they could see you, you wanting this more committed relationship. So, for how you see them, the Strength card and the Queen of Cups. Now the Strength card is showing it could be a time to meditate, contemplate, spend some time alone, even if you're in a committed relationship and you got 19 children. So don't allow yourself to spend time in preoccupation and fear because the outward things are probably going all right. But what's most important is keeping your head on straight. Not only do you have the ability, but you have the responsibility. So conquer your fears, control your impulses, and never lose patience with what you're, what you're doing. So you see them like the strength card. Um, there's a strong connection here, and it's mutually supportive. Strength card is about self-love, unconditional love, self-respect. This person is very acceptant and patience, patient, and you can see them wanting a strong relationship with you. They're, they're ready to conquer any fears that they have and make this a mutually supportive and beneficial connection. Now, it's with the Queen of Cups, which tells you that... Um, uh, Queen of Cups is about a woman who will be very helpful to you. It reminds us to bring love, compassion to our work, and even that's possible if we work in a factory with objects all day rather than people. Queen of Cups, it's a very positive outlook about a relationship if you're single. It's important for you to get out and socialize. Yeah, because a very positive romance could be on the horizon. So this is how you see them also, like the Queen of Cups. Um, you see them wanting to nurture and heal this connection. Any problems that come up, they're very supportive. And um, 
There's a lot of love that they have for you. Love and compassion. Very positive for how you you see them. Yeah, you see them this way towards you. Strong, and they have a lot of love and compassion. They want to nurture and fix whatever problems come up. Now let's take a look at why it's happening. Page of Cups and Three of Pentacles. Page of Cups is showing in this picture, you see how these three people, they're hanging out at the park, they're halfway naked, they're turning up a bottle. It's showing you need to play, dream, have a little fun. It can sometimes mean that you're taking yourself way too seriously. You've probably heard the saying before. The one thing that I've learned over the years is the difference between taking one's work seriously and taking oneself seriously. The first is imperative and the second can be a disaster. You have to know the difference. Now, this is one of the reasons why it's happening. It is a playful energy. Um, very studious. Happy surprises. There's, there's a dream, it's dream feeling here. Um, the Page of Cups is about opening your heart to intimacy. Or just opening your heart and there's a lot of intimacy. Now, it's with the Three of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles is a very positive card in the tarot. Especially when it comes to work, career questions. But it's a good overall card. It means that you're doing well. Three of Pentacles, it tells you that people around you, they appreciate you and your efforts. And they notice the type of work you do, even if you don't get paid for it. It tells you to keep doing what you're doing because you're right on track. There could be some room for improvement, but you will not have to scrap something and then start again. So, Three of Pentacles is why it's happening. There's teamwork, collaboration. Uh, you or your person could offer great benefits. That's what the Three of Pentacles is about, some benefits. So, maybe your person has a great 401k. Maybe they got a great life insurance policy. Maybe they're a great lover. They offer benefits, which is always a good thing. Always. So, why don't we recap this reading? This way we can get the complete picture. So, Jim and I, your person, they see you as a dream come true. Um, Ten of Cups, they want um, commitment, or they see you wanting commitment. Uh, it's just happy overall. It's a happy, doing well, everything is good. Overall, you got the Nine of Cups and the Ten of Cups. Everyone wants these two and these two cards in a reading. Dream come true, blessed and satisfied. That's how they see you feeling about them, or they could feel this way about you. Now you also see, you see them as uh, uh, they want to support this connection. It's mutually supportive. They're feeling. And uh, they want this connection to be strong. They want it to stand the test of time. They want to nurture and heal whatever problems come up. So they're willing to put in the effort and the energy. There's love here with this Queen of Cups. This person has a lot of love for you. Loving, supportive, compassion. Now... We got this page of cups here. Um, um, and we got the high priestess here also. So this person that you're dealing with, they got a lot of attraction for you. They got a lot of mojo for you, Gemini. Um, they're willing to bring balance. Because temperance is here. Temperance is here. They're willing to balance out whatever issues that come up. Yeah, they're willing to deal with whatever problems come up. This is a beautiful reading so far. Yeah, and it's it um, 
adds a bump. It adds this three of pinnacles here. It puts icing on the cake. Um, they offer benefits. Maybe they're a great lover. With the three of pinnacles here. Or they just got great benefits. Maybe they're financially stable. And um, you, you two do a lot of, you enjoy fun times, good times together. Yeah, this is a really good reading. And if this is not someone that you're dealing with, then you're either about to experience some good situations, some happy times. Someone could be, um, you could be the beneficiary of something of value with the Three of Pentacles here. Uh, all positive cards. And if you're not dealing with someone, someone could be coming towards you like this. Someone could be coming in like this. So keep your eyes on the prize. It sounds good. I like the way your person sees you. And I like the way you see them. They want to support, heal, and be strong for you and nurture this connection and you have a lot of happy uh, feelings towards this person and you you want the connection to go to the next level um, you want the end all be all with the ten of cups it could go to marriage and bless and satisfy you guys have a lot, a lot of playful times and a lot of playful energy coming up for you if that's not what's already in the if that's not what's already going on.